this library video will provide a brief overview of how to conduct a literature review. The objectives of a literature review are to summarize what existing literature says about a topic, compare and contrast different views on that topic, highlight gaps in the research, and evaluate aspects of how the research in the area has been conducted. Conducting a literature review will require you to find scholarly resources and a good place to start is the library search box. Click here for more information on searching the library search box. Useful resources for your subject area can also be found in the library subject guides. Under quick links, click on subject guides. I'm going to choose the communication subject guide. The subject guides contain reference resources and databases. Depending on how comprehensive your literature review needs to be, it may be necessary for you to search individual databases. Click here for demonstrations on how to use the databases from EBSCO and ProQuest. Always approach your reading of the literature in a critical manner. When you read, ask yourself the following questions. What is the author trying to discover? What is the research trying to measure? Are the results accurate and valid? Do the findings agree with other research or do they show major points of difference? After completing your research, start writing your literature review. Generally, a literature review will consist of an introduction, body and conclusion. Keep in mind that this is not an annotated bibliography. Here are some points you should consider. To make the literature review easier to write, plan before you start and arrange your discussion in a logical order. Ensure you define all key concepts and terms. Include the most relevant works on your topic. Do not include everything you find. Arrange your writing by ideas or themes, not by chronology. Discuss and link your ideas. Don't just list what you have read. You need to compare and contrast key concepts. Back up your analysis. Everything presented should have academic value and research to support it. Conclude with a summary. Finish by highlighting the key findings from the research and identify further research needed. All resources used should be correctly referenced. Tips to bear in mind are Use academic language. Ensure you use a formal and scholarly tone. Reference list of relevant articles will lead you to other relevant resources. Note the publishing details of all resources you consult to include in your bibliography or reference list. Always credit any ideas you present by using properly cited references. If you are unsure about referencing, please see the library's referencing and citation guides. To summarize, the basic process of a literature review is to select your sources, read and evaluate the literature, then interpret relationships of similarity and difference in what you have read. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please contact the library.